Sadly, there are more big cats living in captivity than in the wild today. With an estimated 10 to 20,000 privately owned exotic cats in the United States alone, Unfortunately, many of these animals don't live in zoos or accredited wildlife facilities. Lack of government regulations has turned private exotic animal ownership into a billion dollar industry where tiger cubs can be purchased for less than a purebred dog. At first, cute and cuddly, big cats grow quickly into dangerous carnivores requiring almost $10,000 a year for proper feeding, housing, and care. After becoming too difficult or expensive for their owners, many animals are abandoned or end up languishing in small backyard pens, doomed to live out their lives in deplorable conditions. Unlike domestic dogs and cats, there are few adoption alternatives for unwanted exotic wildlife. That's how our story begins. In 1978, animal lovers Don and Hilda Jackson saved Bum a lion cub who had been abandoned at a Little Rock, Arkansas motel. Don agreed to take the malnourished young lion that was being kept chained to a tree, and using his past experience working at a zoo, Don and his family provided Bum with a balanced diet and quickly turned the lion's health around. It didn't take long for the word to spread about Jackson's lion, and soon more unwanted exotic cats found their door. Realizing how many neglected exotic animals were suffering, the Jacksons started building a sanctuary. Founded in 1992 as a nonprofit organization providing lifetime homes for abandoned and neglected big cats, Turpentine Creek Wildlife Refuge has grown to become one of the largest exotic cat sanctuaries in America, with more than 130 tigers, lions, cougars, leopards, and servals. Open to the public every day except Christmas Day, the 450-acre USDA license facility lies just seven miles south of historic Eureka Springs, Arkansas, and hosts more than 35,000 visitors each year. In addition to adopting neglected wildlife from individuals, the refuge has spearheaded some of the largest wildlife rescues in the country, including the recent relocation of 28 tigers and cougars to a new area at the refuge called Rescue Ridge. Turpentine Creek also plays an important educational role. Thousands of school children have been touched by the refuge through field trips and school presentations. Since its inception in 1997, the refuge's intern program has graduated more than 350 college students from leading schools around the world. Interns received hands-on experience with daily responsibilities ranging from habitat cleaning, animal feeding, and visitor education through guided walking tours and keeper talks. The refuge continues to add new facilities and activities, creating a total immersion experience for guests, including the safari lodges and other overnight accommodations, an RV park and camping area, and a variety of special fundraising events throughout the year. As a result, Turpentine Creek has been voted one of the top 10 attractions in Arkansas and rated the number one attraction in Eureka Springs by TripAdvisor.com. What does the future hold for Turpentine Creek? As more states adopt legislation controlling private ownership of exotic wildlife, the number of abandoned animals will grow dramatically, forcing accredited facilities like Turpentine Creek to expand their facilities. Planned improvements include construction of an on-site veterinary clinic, conversion of the few remaining concrete enclosures to large natural habitats, and an observation tower over Rescue Ridge. The refuge needs ongoing support of caring individuals and community businesses, since tax-deductible donations pay the majority of their annual operating expenses. Think globally and act locally by helping us help them. While they can't be free, they can be loved. For more information, please visit turpentinecreek.org.